Hi, Quadcopter 101 here. What I got for you today is a, a maiden flight of my HJ818 Pathfinder uh, hexacopter. Uh, something unusual, a little bit different for today's flight. Um, I just got this in a couple hours ago. I had to come out here and try it out. It's <laughs> interesting looking hexacopter. Um, there's really nothing special in the features that it has uh, other than it's a hexacopter and uh, it also comes with uh, in two other versions. I got the cameraless version because I'm interested in using this for carrying my uh, 808 keychain camera and if it has enough power with these extra two uh, motors possibly my even my um, Mebius camera. But uh, again it does come in two other versions uh, one with a 0.3 megapixel camera and one with a um, 2 megapixel camera. Um, again, I did not get that uh, version. Uh, the controller for it um, is uh, just your usual controller. This is the button for operating the camera if you have the camera uh, mode version. Uh, this is the upper, let me put down the, the hexacopter for a second. This is the button for flips. If you want to change the, the rates, the yaw rates, uh, you push down on what would be the throttle trim button. And if you want to turn the lights on and off, you push up on, well, again, what would be the throttle trim button. So that's the features of the uh, controller. Um, it's advertised at 100 meter range. Uh, I'm not going to actually send it out 100 meters. I'm going to keep it close here for this inaugural flight. Uh, let's just go into flight and see how it performs. Again, I got a wind here, a little bit over five miles per hour, a little breezy today. Okay, turn the hexacopter on. And. Okay, I'm bound. I am going to take off in low rate, and if, it, if I don't like what, how it's flying, I'm going to increase the rate. So here we go, inaugural takeoff. Ah, it seems to be very steady. Oh, I forgot to mention, this thing is plastic and metal. All those silver pieces you saw on there are actually a lightweight aluminum alloy. I'm surprised at that. Pretty cool looking hexacopter. Okay, I'm going to send it upwind. It's very quiet for a uh, six bladed <laughs> vehicle. I thought it'd be louder than that. I had a little hiccup there. I'm rotating it. Let's send it up higher. Let's send it up farther. It's flying in the breeze right now. It seems to be able to hold that breeze or had another little drop out there. That's that's unusual. Well, I don't know if it's unusual or not. That was out at about 30 meters. <laughs> Let's send it up a little higher, see if we can go a little higher. Increasing throttle. Got another drop out there. Now I'm flying in a somewhat close to a housing area over there, so this could be Wi Fi interference. Increasing altitude. Okay, and I'm bringing it back down. So that's probably its range error, about uh, 70 meters it looked like. I'm going to bring it back in close. Now, as with all quadcopters or these toy version quadcopters, hexacopters, um, you can make slight modifications to the transmitter and if indeed that is the range of this thing I am going to consider modifying its transmitter to get better range on it but it is flying in the wind again this is its first flight I'm gonna go up and uh, 
increase the mode okay that was two beeps this should be expert mode if it has an expert mode <laughs> I'm gonna click it one more time and see if we get three beeps no it's one I guess it's beginner and expert mode I'm in expert mode now there in expert mode is its uh, funnels <laughs> I'll set it up upstream again into the wind okay these are left funnels and I think my battery's gone I noticed it was uh, requiring extra power there at the end. So that was the inaugural flight <laughs> of the HJ-818. Uh, tomorrow morning there should be some good weather. I'm going to try it again, um, see what we can do. I'm probably try to carry a 808 keychain camera with it tomorrow, see how that works out. But uh, well, there's, the lights aren't flashing, so there still might be some more power on it. Let's see here. Oh yeah, going back to beginner, seems to be more stable in beginner mode than expert mode. Again, I'm fighting a wind here, but it, it can fight a wind. It's got two propel blue propellers on the front, two bright green LEDs on the back to help you with orientation. If you see the green LEDs, that's the back end pointed toward you. Let's set it out, of, out and back again, upwind. Going to hover. That's got a real nice yaw rate on it. As you saw there, go do that again. Look at that yaw. <laughs> okay, let's see if it flips. Which button was the flip button? That one there. That one. Okay. Oh, it flips nicely. Okay. I saw it blinking that time. That was the battery, I believe. Again, this is a first flight, just getting the handle of it. Um, are we blinking? Yeah, we're blinking. So that's the end of that battery. That uh, flip there killed the battery. We'll give it another try tomorrow and see how it works. But uh, again, interesting quadcopter. Again, this is all metal, believe it or not. Uh, metal alloy, uh, aluminum alloy. So, okay, quadcopter 101 with HJ818 Pathfinder. It's inaugural flight. Hope you enjoyed it. Quite Copter 101 signing out.